All right, guys, I have an even newer setup. So if you couldn't tell, basically, you should be able to see my face pretty well because I got the light up there. It was over there for a while, and actually, it's always been over there, but now it's up there. In fact, this entire area is pretty much redone completely. If you guys want to see my gaming setup in the future and stuff like that, it's going to be a very short video, very short video, then I'd be sure to bring that to you guys. So pretty much to start the video, we're going to be playing in the Super Bowl. I'm just going to open these two packs. we got a wheel of quick sell, which is not going to be that much. It's going to be probably a thousand coins. I rarely... Thanks EA for giving me a good quick sell. And then we're going to have this out of position Mike Evans strong safety. Um, we're going to get two of these bad boys. So they'll quick sell for 310 snow. This thing, Mutt Weekly Booster Pack. We're going to be opening this. Um, so our ED2, we're going to do our quick sell thing. I'm going to choose a training because like I said in the last video, I need to work on getting my players to sprinter. So that's definitely what we're going to be doing there. So we'll just quick sell this real quick. Man, I got my 50 coins for opening a pack in the store. And then we'll go over here, open our 82 overall, get our 82 overall. I rarely ever get anything higher than an A2. But now that I said that, yeah, 83. That's what I figured was going to happen. Holy cow, that John Randall it was worth 40, about 40,000 coins. So I definitely say that's a W. So here we go. We're going to be hopping into the Super Bowl. Um, like I said, we got no other different team changes or anything like that. But um, I will be bringing you a weekend league gameplay. Um, I will play one of my last games on Sunday, record that, upload it for Monday, and that's how that's going to go. So like I said, teams, pretty it's literally the exact same thing as um, yesterday's gameplay. But uh, let's hop in this video, and hopefully we can get a dub in the Super Bowl. I have not gotten a win in the Super Bowl yet in my Madden Ultimate Team career. Just putting that out there. So comment question of the day. Yesterday I asked you guys who you thought would be the AFC Championship. And I told you guys that I thought the Chiefs and the Chargers would be in the AFC Championship and if it was able to happen. So now I'm going to ask you about the NFC Championship. So like I said, if it can happen, this is if it can happen, I think in the NFC Championship is going to be the Saints versus the Chicago Bears. To be honest, I feel like the Super Bowl is definitely going to be the Chicago Bears versus the Chargers. I feel like that's what the Super Bowl is going to be. The Chargers are on fire and the Bears are on fire. Number one defense usually always makes it to the Super Bowl, except for last year um, with the Jags. They got screwed over there with um, Tom Brady. But uh, we got a pretty much even team here. So I'm actually glad we're playing in the Super Bowl with an even team. See, yesterday's two gameplays were amazing. I loved playing the second one. That was fantastic. Down three at halftime, down 10-3 at halftime, and I come back and win 18 to 10. That was my favorite game I've probably played in Madden in a long time. So first play, he ran cover three. So cover three, I'm gonna do this. Hopefully he doesn't blitz or anything. No blitz, no blitz. Tyreek Hill, and we're gonna get that off, luckily. So his first way to go is flat, so. We're going to try to take advantage of that here. Seems like he's backing off now. That's weird. Um, We'll hit Tyreek Hill. I'll take that. If you're going to give it to me, I'll take it. Let's see what we can do here. We're going to hit Tyreek Hill with the out route. Going to be getting down to the 17-yard line. All right, Christian McCaffrey, what you got? Oh, he's backing off in coverage. This is even better. And his user's on the opposite side of the field. Christian McCaffrey, can you get in the end zone? But you will get us the first down. Dude, I'm telling you, Christian McCaffrey seems like the best running back in the game and have only played a couple games with him. Oh, this is a touchdown all day long. Touchdown all day long. Touchdown all day long. Ricky Williams into the end zone for the touchdown. You already know what we're doing. Oh, boy. Another guy in this freaking formation, bro. You got to be joking. I can't stand when people run PA crossers all day long, bro. I can't stand it. That's out of bounds. Okay, I completely screwed up my, with my adjustments there. I completely screwed up with my adjustments. Swat it, swat it. Actually, probably should have picked that because he's probably going to go for it. Are we getting the opportunity to go up by two scores right now? So this is a good opportunity. I'm going to flip this. No, I'm not. He's, he's backing off, dude. I don't know why you're backing off. 
They're going to give me a great running lanes by backing off. There you go, Ricky Williams getting up in a five-yard game. He's going to back off again. I'm just going to hit Christian McCaffrey. Before. No, I'm not, actually. I'll hit Travis Kelsey, though. Travis Kelsey getting the reception. Down to the 47. We are rolling right now in offense. Nothing is stopping us right now. Let's see if we can hit Hill. Let's see if we can hit Hill. We won't, but we will hit Christian McCaffrey, baby. Get that juke. Breaking tackles, Christian McCaffrey fighting for more yards down to the nine. We're going to head right into our goal line offense. See if we can get something. We're going up the middle. He's spreading. Going right up the middle. Ricky Williams down to the two. He's going in this formation again. And I don't know why because we scored a touchdown on it. So I don't know why he feels that's good because we're in the end zone again. This is exactly what I wanted you to do. You saw that I was going for two, so you just picked some random goal line coverage, and this is going to be a two-point conversion. That's what I'm talking about, 14-9. All right, let's see what he's going to do. I'm not going to come out in my blitz right now. I'm just going to come out in a base coverage. I might get screwed here. Okay, this is... This is not... Yeah, that's just verticals. That's just verticals. There you go, Landon Collins. All right, here we go. Third and ten. Third and ten. We got to get that sack. We got. There we go. There's the sack. Fourth down. Oh, is he leaving? All right, my man is staying in the game. He's punting right now. So we'll see what happens. If we get 20, probably 17 or 21 up. Probably 21 to be honest. There's. I don't think there's a chance that this guy's staying in the game. So. Thank goodness you picked that up. Holy crap. I wish when if people rage quit, like it would sh still show you the celebration if you were winning at that point in time. It kind of sucks that they don't do that. But I don't care what happens. I'm throwing it to Julio Jones on this play. I am throwing it to Julio Jones. And he dropped it. Let's see how our PF, PAF slide does here. Move Christian McCaffrey out. And let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Tyree Kill getting that possession catch. I know there is going to be some game where I will be getting Julio Jones the ball, but I just want to get him the ball and show you guys like that he's fantastic, and I can't right now. But I'll hit him now, Julio Jones. He's got a man complete. Does that tell you anything? I knew something like this would happen. I'm killing him in the double halfback backfield offense, so he decides, you know what, I'm going to do this too. But to be honest, it's really not going to work for you, buddy. Sack. Especially at the fact that he doesn't have the same plays I do, so that's another reason why it's not going to work. Let's go. Let's go. He's going to be throwing it up to Julio, swat it. Or don't. I'd be willing to put money on the line that he does that same thing again because it worked. And then I'm going to have Stephon Gilmore go for a pick. Nope, he's not. He's going to go slants. He's going slants. He's going to motion people up. Get the pick. There you go. Ryan Shazier interception. Use your pick. Can we get a pick six here? I need some inter return interception yards for Ryan Caesar. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm forced it. Well, this is taken in. It's complete. And that one results in. Who is that? That's who yo Jones, baby. That's who that is. But nowadays. At this point, I can honestly do whatever I want. I can just fool around if I want to, because at this point, I am not really scared of this guy's offense, because he can't do much of this game. I'm going to try a run play here, and then if we don't get it, then I'll just take my points. I'm just going to be a good guy here. If I don't get this first down, okay, I got the first down. Ricky Williams, up to the point. I don't know how he does these one-handed catches all the time. It's unbelievable. Why are you letting off in coverage, man? Why are you letting off Ricky Williams in the end zone? Drops it. I'm going to take my points. I'm going to be a good guy here. There's no reason to go up by more. First and 10. Ryan stays here. And we're going to get another sack. Okay, he's going to be running post routes. Nope, he's not going to be running post routes. And Deion Sanders. Oh, Stephon Gilmore is going to get a pick. Stephon Gilmore is going to get a pick. Can he get a pick six, though? Is he too slow? I think he is. 
Go, Mahomes. Slide. Going with the sneak to get the first down. By the way, guys, I am going to be uploading Fortnite on the weekends. I don't know if I'm going to be putting up two episodes or one episode this weekend. If I put up one episode, that means I will not be uploading on Sunday. I will just be uploading on Saturday, just putting that out there. So there will be Fortnite coming out on my channel. Um, I do plan on uploading it and I want to make a series with some of my friends of us just playing it and getting dubs and stuff like that After, Like I haven't played it in forever. So like I don't know if I'm gonna be good I don't know if I'm gonna be bad or what we're gonna try this one. Let's see how this one does this Because I know a lot of you guys have been wanting Fortnite and I'm gonna give it to you Okay, when we get back on offense, I am going to milk the clock because my internet is known for disconnecting at stupid points. So I am not going to let this guy win this game off of me blagging out. And I would be extremely mad if that actually happened. So I'm going to milk this clock out. Possibly end the third quarter on this drive. I mean, it would be sick if I could just force a shutout against this against this guy, and we're gonna take it into the end zone. So this guy did message me, and that's what he was doing when the game was paused for a long time. Um, he pretty much messaged me like, "Yo, you're the better team. Can you just let me win? It's my Super Bowl." And I'm like, "It's my Super Bowl too, but like." I'm not just gonna give you a win. If you want to win against me, I want you to earn the win. I'm not just gonna give it to you. So, I mean, that's how I roll. I feel bad for the guy. Not gonna lie, but like, it's my Super Bowl too. I've never won a Super Bowl in Madden before. And to be honest, I'm probably getting lucky right now because this guy's not really that good. So, but I sent him a message back. I said like, it's my Super Bowl too, and I'm not leaving. So that's pretty much all I said. But so now he's actually got two clock on too as well, and I think he's gonna be running the ball and just going down like that for the rest. So fourth and five here, and he might be just going down, and he's going. Down. To be honest, I might just see you guys until the Super Bowl ending, because honestly, like he's going in quarters, so I think he's just giving me the opportunity to just run the clock out now at this point. So, I'll just see you guys once we're at the Super Bowl celebration. Well, we're about to make this a 40-point game here. At least try to. Gonna go with the halfback dive up the middle. Ricky Williams breaking the tackle, and he's into the end zone for the touchdown as time expires. Big man finally catches the two-point conversion. We're gonna win the game 44 to 0 Winning the Super Bowl. That is what I'm talking about. Probably Patrick Mahomes is just gonna be the MVP. To be honest, like almost 300 passing yards, so it would make complete sense why he would be. And Ricky Williams is actually going to be the Super Bowl MVP. That's kind of weird. Not going to lie. Well, I mean, he had three touchdowns, so I guess that kind of makes sense. And uh, there's the pointless Lombardi trophy. I mean, it's not really going to mean anything that we did it. But wait, are we missing something here? The Buffalo Bills won the Super Bowl. It's about freaking time that that happened. Buffalo Bills won the Super Bowl. Brian Chazier, Patrick Mahomes, Christian McCaffrey, Julio Jones, all offensive players. No, no defensive players. But uh, that is going to be the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys drop a like down below. That'd be absolutely fantastic. If you guys are new to your channel, make sure you subscribe. Row to 10,000 subs. And, uh, yeah. I'll be posting some Fortnite tomorrow most likely, so be ready for that. For all you Fortnite lovers, be ready, because it's coming. Peace out.